Hey everybody, welcome back to another video with your casual keyboard guy. Um, today's lesson is going to be on a song titled Don't Lose Sight by Lawrence. This song is being sponsored by my subscriber, Brian Hall. Thank you for the donation, my friend. So let's uh, get into this one. Um, it's got a little gospel feel to it. Pretty, uh, pretty, uh, pretty nice song. Uh, I never heard of this group, but um, definitely a fan. So let's um, let's get into this. I'm gonna play my beat, and you know me, play through a little bit, and then guess what? Break it down, break it down. Let's get it. Hey, hey. There you go. One, two, three. Hey. Alright, so this got a lot of little gospel stuff in there. What is that? You know, some nice little stuff in there with the organ and stuff, but let's get it. So that's the little playthrough. So of course at the end I'm gonna let it let the beat play and you can kinda of play along with it. And um but let's go back to our piano so we can learn this bad boy. So basically, um this song is pretty much like a loop of some some chords, so let's uh, let's get into it. So we're in the key of F, one flat. So let's uh let's learn that first chord. So what I'm doing on that first chord is doing an F major nine. So I'm doing a F in the bass, and then I'm doing an A C E G in the right for that first chord. Okay, so. So, first chord, second chord is going to be A minor, 7. So, you got A in the bass, you got G, C, and E in the right. Okay, A in the bass, G, C, E. Next chord is going to be a diminished chord, really a passing chord. You got this up, D flat, diminished 7. So, you got D flat, you got G, you got uh, B flat. You got D flat, you got E. Okay. So after this chord, we got a D minor. So you got D's in the bass. Then you got A, D, F. Okay. So. Try that more time and two, three. One more time and two, three. All right. Then you got this little quick little. So that's real dope. So what I'm doing here is D minor seven. So I'm doing a D in the bass. I'm doing C F. And A in the right, and everything goes down chromatically, uh, chromatically, with, which means not skipping any notes. So we're going from the D, C, F, A, then we're going down a half step to the D flat, then we're going B, E, and A flat. Okay. And then we're going down another half step to C, and then we're going to do B flat, D flat, B flat. E flat and G. So D minor seven, half step down, D flat minor seven, another half step down, C minor seven. So something like that. So you got do it slow. Hold 
So that wasn't the rhythm because I fumbled, but um, so after you go. And. So it comes really quick. So after you hit that. And. That's the, the, the so cat uh, man, it's hard to do it slow, it's funny, it's harder to do it slow to eh. So just you know, just loop that, practice that part. Um, that's because that's really quick. And then guess what? You got another little quick change. So you're gonna have, all right. So what that's gonna be is, and I'm making a chord simple so it'd be easier to play. So you got a C minor, um, seven. So, so you land on a C minor seven. So you're gonna just. So now you're gonna play the next. Passing off of the same chord, so you got bah, bah, bah. Then you go hit that same chord, C minor seven. <clears throat> then you're gonna um, go down to the F bass, and then your B flat is gonna come down to A. So you kind of still got that E flat and G up top, and then your B flat is gonna come down to A, and your bass is gonna go down to F. So you can, now you got this F uh, seven nine, and then we're gonna end on. This B flat major seven. So you got B flat, A, D, F. So, but it's really fast. So let me do it slow though. Two, two, two. All right. So you got. Uh, See how fast that is? So you just gotta practice this slow. So once you get the chords, bah, bah, bah. once you get those chords, you know, it'll be easier to um, get the timing once you learn the chords. All right? Um, after that part, so you gotta do it from the top. So, got some some more moving chords. So after you do the, uh, you gotta go back to that A minor seven, which we learned already. A G C E. And then we gonna have a nice little jazzy chord. So let's do D in the bass. Then we got a, a um a G flat C. F, real pretty chord. All right, G, D in the bass, G flat, C, F. Then we're gonna go to a uh, G flat diminished seven. So we got G flat in the bass, then G flat in the, in the right, A, C, and E flat. Okay. And then we're going to go up to the G minor 7. So. So you see that rhythm? Oh, man. But like I said, learn the chords first. Which the chords I just showed you were the, um, were from the, um, uh, what is it? Ba, 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 ba. Then we went to the A minor. This really, this augmented D chord, D sharp, D seven sharp nine, G flat diminished seven. Then we land on this G minor seven, G to bass F B flat D in the right, B F B flat D in the right. 
Okay. And then we're going to have... A C, non sus four, and this is gonna take us back to the top. So C in the bass, B flat, D, F. Okay? And that's essentially the whole song. Um, they kinda got a lot of studio stuff going on. They got the organ kind of ripping stuff. The piano's doing little licks like little stuff like that. Um, but let me just go through it one more time, then I'll show you a couple of the the, the, the licks that I hear. Um, so you got So let me give you that rhythm. So on that last part, we'll go through it again. And, and, and. It's kind of hard to count that, but. So that, that last part, so after you go. And, and. So you got. So if you go ba ba ba, I believe that's how I go. Okay, uh, last time. So fast. All right. So what that is, that's a nice little look you could do. It's just like I'm using the F pentatonic. So you're going C, D, F, G, A. This is what you could do, like when you get back to the F, because you, you know you, the F got so much space on it. So, so again, a C D F G A, and then I'm doing a trill off the G to the A flat. So, do -do -do. so G A flat G F. Da -da -da -da. So, boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. so I'm, I'm flicking from the G to the A too. So watch this. Boom, boom. So that you can do on that and then another thing they do is something like that so what that is that's an f chord so you got c f G, a and then they're doing the like going to a b flat so it's d f b flat and it's back down so you move the outside notes and the f stay in there so, so that comes out like almost like when they go um uh, tell myself uh, I myself when I sleep at night. Don't look back. Something like that. So let me show you what that other part is. So, and then you got B flat F, B flat D, and then you got F. So basically, what it is is just like a a one to a four chord. So you're going from the F triad to the four, which is the B flat chord. But we just inverting the B flat. And even right here, that's the F, still the F, but different inversion. So that's F, uh, what is this? Uh, root, first, second position, F. And then you've got the B flat. So. So watch this. Uh, tell myself, sleep at night. Don't look back. See, that's how it would fit. So let me show you this other thing that I did um, that I forgot I did it, but um, it's not in the song, but I think it'd be cool to kind of change up the, you know, the, the, doing the same thing over and over again. So uh, one thing that I did was when I went to, um, watch this. So that's something that, that I can show you real fast. So basically what I do is instead of doing that, uh, instead of doing that, but Instead of going like that little, 
like that part, you'll just do like some long chords. So you'll do, and essentially it's the same chord, so don't get scared. It's just now we're just doing them like, um, we're just going down chromatically all the way to the B flat mm -hmm. instead of doing the two five ones, which is the, you know, uh, uh, cause, cause, cause this is chromatic right here, and then we do a two five one right here. So now we're gonna instead of just breaking right here and doing a two five, we're gonna just keep going down. So watch this. So D minor seven, which we already learned. Then we go half step down to the to the D flat minor seven. Then another half step down to the C. Now this time we're gonna do a little something different. We're gonna do this uh, G major add two over B, really pretty. So you got G and uh, B in the bass. You got A, D, and you got a G. And then we're gonna land on that that B flat major seven. And I'm just flicking from the C to the D. So I'm coming down with the outside part of the chord, C D. So watch this. Whew, that's pretty. All right, so I'm just flicking from the D flat to the D. That's the extra stuff you hear. Okay, and then land on that B flat. So it's how it would go. So hope you guys enjoyed that lesson. If you got any questions, hit your boy up. You know, you can leave me a comment in the uh, comment section or, you know, you can hit me up on Instagram. I'm Casual Keyboard Guy, same name. So if you want to talk to me a little bit more closely. But anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this lesson. Casual Keyboard Guy signing off. Peace. Have a good night. Love you all. Peace.